Ever heard the old phrase, strike when the iron is hot? Well, it's never been hotter than now. All this month at Appalachian Wireless, you can get the Samsung GS6 or the GS6 Edge for just one penny when you send them for service. The Galaxy S6, normally $49.99, now just a penny. The Galaxy S6 Edge, normally $99.99, now just a penny. Strike now while supplies last. Better service, bigger savings. Serving you for the last 25 years at Appalachian Wireless. Tuesday, September 27th, could be a day of change in Jenkins. Voters will have the chance to answer the question, are you in favor of the sale of alcoholic beverages in the city of Jenkins? The question will appear on the ballot, and voters will determine if they want to allow packaged alcohol sales in Jenkins. Mayor Todd DePriest said it's anyone's guess how the election will go. He said he's glad voters will have the chance to decide the direction the city will go. It's a good thing that we got the option to, to vote on it, uh, you know, no matter how your feelings are on it or, or where you stand or, or where your passions are, either way, you know, I'm sure people's going to be strongly against it and some people's going to be strongly for it and, and maybe there's those that in the middle that's not made their mind up, but, you know, it's a good thing that you can go out and vote and, and have some say in what happens in your community and, and, uh, and what your future may be after that. Mayor DePriest said the talk about the local option election has been rather quiet. Only two businesses, Rite Aid and Dollar General, have expressed an interest in offering packaged alcohol sales. The mayor said whatever the outcome, the city is prepared to move forward. Well, if the vote's successful tomorrow and, uh, and the people uh, say that's what they want, then you know, the city will have to enact an ordinance. Uh, after that, have to work with the Kentucky ABC office to uh, find out what else needs to be done to... Uh, to put it into place. Uh, I've had questions on how many uh, places would be able to sell and, and different things like that and really not sure this sort of come on quick and uh, uh, we don't have all that research done but there's plenty of time to get that done after the vote. All voting in Tuesday's local option election will take place at Jenkins Middle High School. Reporting in Jenkins for EKB News, I'm Chris Anderson.